guys. So Armada Wave 3 announced today. We've got uh, this new flotilla. It seems like it's sort of a mini wave because there's only two expansion packs. You've got your Gazanti uh, expansion pack and your Rebel Transport expansion pack. And so it's pretty interesting that they only announced two small expansions as an entire wave. Uh, the question that I've got is this going to be the trend for Armada? Are we only going to get a small amount of expansions per wave or are we going to get more? Uh, maybe there's more coming. We've seen them do that before, especially with the um, the, the X-Wing expansions for the uh, First Order TIE Fighter and the T-70 X-Wing that were retroactively added as a part of Wave 8 for X-Wing. Uh, are they going to do something like that? Um, they just had the, uh, the Gamma show going on right now and there's an Adepticon convention coming up in about two weeks. So maybe there's more to be announced. Um, this new, these new expansions that they have for Wave 3 right now, there's a new flotilla mechanic, so they're cheap ship bases, but you get two small minis on one base kind of to kind of replicate the, you know, the feel on the battlefield. I really like, I mean, these are two ships that I think people wanted. I definitely wanted the Rebel Transport, um, and I like the way that they've done it. I like that it's treated as a ship, it's because you didn't, I didn't want to treat it as a squadron and that it's not just one little transport on a whole base. You have two of them, so that, that just it feels right. Um, but they're cheap, and they basically are thinking, okay, well, I'll just ram. I've seen people ram people with CR-90 swarms, and now you don't have to worry about that because basically they can't cause damage when they ram unless it's to another flotilla. So that's pretty cool. Um, I'm just kind of really disappointed. I wanted to see more. Uh, now, somebody has pointed out that, or a couple of people on the forums have pointed out that the image for their official announcement on uh, FantasyFlightGames.com seems a little bit cropped. Cropped in such a way that maybe the original picture for Wave 3 showed more. Could it be? What do you think? Do you think there's more to Wave 3 than they've showed us so far? Do you think Armada is going to have a full wave? Or do you think we're going to be stuck with only two small expansions per year? Because don't forget, it's been, it was last March when we first got the spoiler for the uh, Imperialist Star Destroyer and Home 1 and, and the Wave 2 expansion. So if it's going to be a whole year with only two small expansions, I'm going to feel kind of disappointed. I'm going to feel cheated. But if this is just a preview of things to come, then I'm very excited. Let me know what you think, and as always, thank you for watching. Uh, continue to like and subscribe, and have a wonderful day.